heaven, hello be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord be with you. Blessed is the fruit of the womb, thy womb, Jesus. And blessed is the fruit of those who are comforted. God, thank you very much. Can we now have the national anthem to be led by the police band? Honorable ministers here present, the governors, and all the dignitaries to cultivate in short, and the delegates, the international delegates, we now get into the official closing program. Next, on the agenda, we're going to have a special remarks by the governor of Central Riva region, the host governor, al Kanyituri. Governor, you're welcome. Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, Rebun Alameen. Alhamdulillah, Rebun Alameen. Honorable Minister of Youth and Sport, Honorable Minister of Justice, Regional Governors here present, National Assembly, Assembly Members here present, the chief of Opoflodu, the Alcalo of Bantanto and Bansang, security chiefs here present, delegates from all our regions, local and national organizing committee, the mayor of the deputy mayor of Ganyo here present, delegates from Giri Bissau. Ladies and gentlemen, and all other protocols duly observed. I want to first of all and foremost thank Allah the Almighty for guiding us safely through a memorable week of dialoguing, sporting activities, fanfare, and etc. My speech will humbly be all about registering my heartfelt thanks to all who made NACOF 2012 a resounding success. This success I'm gladly trumpeting today would not have been registered without the ever intervention of the star of the nation, the hope of the youth, the savior of the women, and the future of generations yet to born. Hunger was totally scared away from the NACOF village. Food was in abundance and peace and security was all over during this week. I therefore implore on all of you gathered here today to sincerely join me in thanking His Excellency the President, Chief Professor Dr. Alaji Yaya A.J. Yijame, for this donation in full stuff, meat, and cars, which was totally needed for our feeding and organizing of this activity. The plentiful nature of the gifts of these gifts was even felt by Amitai Senior Secondary School, who also benefited a great deal. I therefore register my heartfelt thanks to His Excellency. In the same vein, I want to thank Narek 
for, for their wonderful contribution in the realization of NECOF 2012. They do not only help in lightening up of the village, but they stay on staff all throughout the week to ensure reliable and constant power. I, I also along this line thank all organizations who in their bid to exercise their social corporate re responsibilities join hands in the staging of this remarkable event. I want to thank the inhabitants of the local committee that, that flanked their, the, their venue for their impliging participation from period of building of the event to its successful unfolding. I want to register my heartfelt thanks to the people of Bantanto, especially the women, for their generosity in supplying water to the delegates. By extension, I want to recognize the efforts of the Bansang Fire Station for also providing the venue with water. To the people of Bansang, I say thanks for the open arms and the endless generosity towards the guests who always move in town. I also say thanks to Janyambure Prisons for the constant provision of firewood to the program all throughout the event. I want to seize this opportunity to gladly and sincerely thank all regions that convived in Bansang for this memorable event. They did not only answer to our call, but they were represented in huge numbers. I cannot also conclude my speech without also thanking the security personnel tasked to provide security to the event. No breach of security was witnessed during our stay here. Thus, I would also congratulate all those who convived to this remarkable event. As you have paid heed to the teaching of our beloved leader, His Excellency the President, for nurturing the peace and promoting broadening light ties, now that the curtains of NACOF 2012 are being brought down. I urge all those who represented their respective regions to not only reflect on the positive of the event, but to spread the gospel back to their people upon returning home. I will not only do justice without thanking those who provided entertainment during the event. Hence, every youth is associated with entertainment and fanfare. The ambience was never relenting, as mentioned by all, by all and sundry. On the side of the sporting activities, I want to congratulate all the winners of sporting disciplines stage here. I believe everyone was a winner here. The spirit on behalf of the whole Central River region to any person or region who faced any form of difficulty during the program. Even though, as host region, we did everything in our power to have a hitch-free neck of 2012. It is obvious that not everything went perfect. Against this backdrop, I humbly apologize for any shortcoming during this period of one week gathering. I will wrap up by wishing all regions, guests, journalists, security personnel, a safe journey back home and hope NACOP 2012 would be for a long time. I therefore say a big thank you for honoring all of you, all the regions, 
and everybody for honoring our call.